my channel, Hola Dilcia. And today's video, we are going to get to know me. You guys are gonna ask me some questions which I've already printed out and I'm gonna answer them here on this video. So stay tuned, okay? Bye. All right, welcome back. So let's go ahead and answer these questions. Our first question is, what is your full name? My full name is Dilcia Alfaro. What does your name mean? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know and I've actually Googled it and I've asked my parents and no answers. So I don't, I don't know, it's just very unique. If you had to change your first name, what would you change it to? Whew. Well, I've really never thought of that. Uh, I always have this, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what I would change it to. I don't know if I look like a Sally or a Jessica or a Maria. You tell me, what do I look like? <laughs> Where were you born? I was born in Houston, Texas, H-Town, baby. Where did you grow up? I grew up here in Nashville, Tennessee. So basically born in Houston, Texas, raised here. I've been here for a, for a long time, about maybe 19 years. Birth date. Well, my birthday is December 18, 1987. Um, hint, hint, it's around the corner. December 18, guys, remember that. What are your favorite things about yourself? Oh, so uh, one of my favorite things about me is I'm actually funny uh, and you know with a lot of practice I'm able to speak in public even though I feel like sometimes I don't make sense and another thing is uh, I really like the fact that I ride motorcycles I'm a girl and I ride so I think I'm pretty cool which of your parents are you closest to? I'm actually closest to my mom. So, yep, yeah, she's she's my best friend. Which of your parents are you more like? I'm more like my mom, for sure. What would your parents have named you if you were the opposite gender? <laughs> so if I was a boy, maybe I would be called Dilcio? Maybe? Do you have any siblings? If so, what are their names? I have an older sister, her name is Chrysia, and then I have a younger sister, her name is Kelly, and I'm the middle one. Do you get along with your siblings? Yes, I actually do get along with my siblings. Um, of course, everybody has different personality and they all like to do different things, but I actually do get along very well with my sisters. I love them. Shout out to them. What is your eye color? I have brown eyes. Maybe you can see brown eyes. What is the most important thing in your life? Most important thing in my life is my family. I love them to death. What is your favorite color? I would say my favorite color is teal, like the flowers in the back. I love that color. What is your favorite food? My favorite food would be, uh, I actually eat everything, but I would say my favorite food would be pupusas. So that's a Salvadorian dish. Sounds pretty nasty, but they're actually really good. What is your favorite sport? My favorite sport is actually soccer. I like soccer. What was your favorite subject in high school? Ooh, well, <laughs> um, lunch, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I would say uh, science, I actually, I actually liked science. Are you scared of heights? Uh, no, I am not scared of heights. Are you high maintenance? Um, I don't think so, maybe. Are you a dog person or a cat person? I think I'm both. I like dogs and cats. Are you a fan of any sports team? Anything that has to do with Texas. So whether it's the Dallas Cowboys, Houston Texans, even like the, um, for basketball, the Spurs. 
the what's about other basketball Texas uh ooh, ooh, you? Ooh. <laughs> I can't even remember anything that has to do with Texas any sport teams from Texas if one loses then I go to the next one so yeah are you a good cook I think I am a good cook can you close your eyes and raise your eyebrows um let me see are they up yep so yes can you touch your nose with your tongue probably not but I can try nope that didn't work can you whistle uh, I think so I really haven't tried since I've had braces so let me see <sighs> <laughs> I guess not. Can you dance? Yes, I can dance. Anything. Do you prefer kissing or cuddling? Ooh, can I do both? Kissing and cuddling? Do you have a tattoo? Yes, I do have one tattoo. Do you have any allergies? You know, at first, I didn't have any allergies, but uh, since I started getting older, I've actually broken out a few times with hives. It was, it's been pretty bad, so I believe that I've developed allergies. Do you have any birthmarks? If so, where? Um, I actually have a birthmark right here un underneath my armpit, and I think somewhere over here I have this. Do you have a best friend? If so, then who? Yes, I do have a best friend. Her name is Duchess, and you've met her. What scares you about aging? Well, the older I get, the sicker I get, or I start getting pains in my joints. So that's scary, and uh, that kind of worries me a little bit. But hey, how many pairs of shoes do you currently own? I have a lot of sneakers. Um, but I will say that I have boots and heels as well. Um, I would say around more than 50. Is that normal? How old do you think you'll be when you get married? Ooh, well, I'm, I'm about to be 32 and I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to get married. I want to, but I, I, I don't know. I don't know. That's a tough one. It's a sad story. Have you forgiven yourself for past personal failure, fail, ugh, failures? Why or why not? Um, you know, it's been really hard. Uh, there has been a lot of failures in my life and things that I regret. And um, in, in, I've actually learned to forgive myself. And, and that kind of motivated me to get better and make things, you know, better and strong. Really, uh put myself down because of all that but um but other than that yeah I've actually gotten better and I've forgiven myself for sure uh if you guys don't know me or you guys haven't noticed I actually ride motorcycles I have been riding for about this is going to be like my ninth year so I've been riding motorcycles for a while uh my first bike was actually a f4 one f4i I said a f4 one what kind of bike is that a f4i Honda. I've always been a Honda girl, so I haven't done anything else but Honda. So Honda F4i, I sold that bike and then I got this one, which was a, it's a 600 CBR RR Honda as well. And yeah, that, that that's my baby. That's my baby. What time do you usually get up in the morning? I usually get up in the morning around 5.30 a.m. What time is your usual bedtime? Mm, it depends on what I'm doing the next day. Usually I go to bed like 10, 30, 11. What is the last thing you watched on TV? I, the last thing I watched on TV was First 48. Yep, I'm all about First 48, guys. What kind of car do you drive? I drive a Honda Civic. Honda, Honda girl, I'm telling you. What languages do you speak? I speak English and Spanish. What was your first job? My first job was actually at a bakery 
I used to work at a bakery here on Nolensville Road. If you guys are from Nashville, Tennessee, Nolensville Road, there was a bakery called Aurora Bakery, and that was my first job when I was 15. On a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being the highest, 1 being the lowest, let's rate my fashion sense. Ooh, my fashion sense, I think it's a 9. Uh, driving skills. Mm, my driving skills is a 10. Your cooking skills. I would say my cooking skills is a 8. How good a kisser are you? Uh, <laughs> um... I've never had any complaint, so I would rate myself a nine, maybe a 10, yeah. What are some of your bad habits? I would say some of my bad habits, it's actually biting my nails and my cheeks, like the inside of my cheeks, I go like, when I'm like nervous or thinking about something or biting my nails, of course, which are disgusting, you should not do that. Do you know how to pump your own gas? Of course I do. I know how to pump my own gas. I know how to change the oil. I know how to change a tire. Hey, yes, I'm a badass. If you have a nickname, what is it? Um, well, I have a few. Uh, my family used to call me Gorda because I was a little chubby baby. Then now I have people, friends, close friends and stuff like that. And they call me Dill instead of Dill or Dill Pickle which I don't like, but it's cute. I guess it's cute. Dill pickle, maybe, yes? Like it? I don't know. Pick one. So, strength or intelligence? Mm, I would say intelligence. Forgiveness or vengeance? Forgiveness. Free healthcare or free education? Free healthcare. Halloween or Valentine's Day? Valentine's Day. Meat or fish? Fish, for sure. Monopoly or chess? I love Monopoly, so I would say Monopoly. Nike or Adidas? I would say Adidas. Uh, texting or phone calls? Texting. Vanilla or chocolate? Ooh, that's a tough one. Can I do both? Vanilla and chocolate? Would you rather go bungee jumping or skydiving? I would go skydiving. Would you rather always be overdressed or always be underdressed? Girl, I would be overdressed. Would you rather be a genius or be wealthy? I would rather be genius. Would you rather do cardio or lift weights? Lift weights? You gotta get them gains. Would you rather have a big stomach or fat cheeks? Big stomach or fat cheeks? Does it mean fat cheeks like fat cheeks or fat cheeks? <laughs> I, would say, I would say fat cheeks. Would you rather live in an apartment or house? House. So oh, I know I said that this video was going to be some personal questions and some business questions, but I believe that I should just do a separate video for just business, just because I have a little bit more questions and the stories are a bit longer and I don't want to make this video too long. So we will have a part two. Stay tuned, hit the subscribe button, and I will give you a part two on this video. Bye. Thank you so much for oh, freak. Thank you so much for what, Dilcia? For what? I guess I'll. Oh God, this is so horrible. One is Christia Alfaro and the other one is Dilcia. Hold on, that's me. Dilcia, oh, jeez, can I not speak right? Yes. So, mm. oh. here we go, here we go, here we go. So, 